Hello and welcome everyone. And uh, there we go with a new video, of course. Uh, we're going to have a look at, at the match against US Lecce, which was played yesterday. And, well, this time, luckily, we can manage to win. As you can see, 3 2 for us. I do not really uh, explain. Uh, I cannot really explain what happened in the sense that we had 44% ball possession, 9 shots against 12, but 7 shots on target, and we could manage to score 3 goals out of 7 shots. Uh, so, this is a very good piece of, uh, of news, of course. 3 set pieces. Well, the opponents, we cannot say the opponents could dominate the match, but we can say we could exploit very well uh, an amount, of, an amount of, of opportunities we have built up. That was not the best possible amount, to be honest. Still, uh, well, what matters the most is the final score, of course. And let's try and see if we see any reason for that. And well, in my opinion, what played a fundamental role is being defensive, of course, and being stronger than the opponents where it matters the most. As you can see, they were playing a 4 4 2 lineup, and usually 4 4 2, at least in real football, is quite weak in the middle. Uh, while it tends to be very strong on the wings. So what happened is that we could actually exploit, especially here, so in this area, the, uh, the higher amount of players. And let's have a look. This guy was injured. So let's see if it played a fundamental role with this. Actually, it did. We were losing, we were losing 2-1, but one of the opponents got injured, unfortunately for him, but luckily for us. And we could, and we could win 3-2. Is that a good result? I don't know. Honestly, I would prefer to see this value higher than the opponents, but, well, in the end... Uh, we could win and this is the most important thing of course so let's have a look at the standings as you can see we could earn three more points and we could start to chase these guys over here and probably these guys over here as well and we'll see how it goes next match will be against Napoli and it's meant to be well, it's probably going to be an easier match than it usually is within this league. But we'll see, uh, because I don't know them, so uh, I might be talking for nothing. So, uh, one more point I have to look at with you guys are the finances. Luckily... No, I'm sorry. I was sure we were earning some money. But we lost a lot, actually, despite a good amount of attendance, not the best possible amount, still a good amount of money for the attendance, a higher amount of money for uh, the TV uh, royalties. Hmm, this thing does not look very positive. Let's have a look at the overall balance of this season. Well, we're still earning 118 million uh, credits because of some transfers, of course. We're going to get some money back from the French player. I can't remember his name at the moment. Oh, he's over here. He's called Dragon. So this player here is meant to is meant to go. Not too soon, though. Uh, because we cannot transfer list him straight away, we have to wait till uh, one whole season has been played with him uh, within the team. So 
we'll have to wait still I think the the situation is quite good uh, finance wise it's not very good but I think we can manage uh, we still have some players to sell so I think we're good to go at the moment so guys I think uh, this is all for today and uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video hopefully you uh, you're happy with the score because I am a lot uh, well not very happy with the overall outcome of the match because uh, of course I would prefer uh, the match to be dominated by us but we can manage to do so therefore uh, thank you again for supporting the team for watching the videos and see you in the next one bye